Hey, what's up everyone? How are you all doing today? Welcome to episode 13 of our Let's Play series of Adeptus Mechanicus with a Heretic DLC. Last mission, we finally had a go at one of the Heretic missions, which was pretty cool. It's a little bit different. I thought it was going to be stupid hard, and luckily I got away with having the mission for survive rounds rather than kill all enemies. I was, I was going to get wiped in another round or two. As such, we haven't got massive amounts of Blackstone. So, I only think we're going to be able to get one upgrade for our guys today. So, let's see who needs it. So, we got a rank 11, 10, 11. So, I'd like to get this guy up to 11. Um, he's already got two guns, a cool few bits and bobs. He's got the basic axe, though. Let's hope we can get him a better axe. Okay, so this guy is going down this route here. So he's going to be a ranged guy. So it's got us one slot free. We can take that out with us 3 to 5 damage. That one in with us 4 to 6. I think that's it, isn't it? 97 left. Okay. I think we've already had a look at what all these missions are. Let's just decide what one we're going to go for. 226 blackstone for that one, that's a lot. I think that one's probably going to be a little tricky still. It says easy, but it's, it's really not going to be. I think this could be a handy little one to have. Give a little Horatio. Yeah, let's do that one. We'll go bust the normal setup until we can unlock any more of these. So we're going to have lots of flayed ones. Hunt and kill all flayed ones. That should be pretty, pretty okay. It's got one diamond, two, still only two. This thing will probably go up to this one. Kind of long and up. From there, it's one, two, three. We could go one. Three, four. Don't know. We'll see how we get on. This is what's eroding the morale of our forces. The influx of flayed ones has left this chamber awash with gore and scraps of skin. It seems this place was used to butcher the bodies of fallen Skatari and turn what flesh they retained into the leathery shrouds worn by the flayed ones. This horrific place cannot be left as it is. Do we get to burn? Collapse the chamber entirely. At least it can become a proper resting place for what remains of these fallen, fallen soldiers. Consecrate. Consecrate the remains with rites of peaceful repose that their souls can join with the infinity of the Omnissiah. Or immolate, burn the remains. At least they can be prevented from polluting the tomb further. I already want to burn. That sounds like it's a bit better off for them. Yeah, let's do that. We got some CP. So, the cohort enacts the traditional rites to be abandoned for consecrating remains of those who cannot be identified from the body parts left behind. However, the decaying remains mingle with some noxious substance in the tomb to produce toxic fumes that 
finally be back the cohort and with severe side effects. So we got some CP, but the awakening has increased a bit because of this noxious substance, I guess. So let's go up to the glyph room. Got a green one. Let's just play it safe. We do have three CP, so we can get a troop unit in if we want. Got flayed ones there. So immortal. Flayed ones. Warrior. Right. him there, get him straight round the back. Push them up to there and hope that if that guy walks round, he's not going to have line of sight on us. And do I? Yeah, I think I'll get the vanguard straight in there as well. So even though it's going to use a couple of our CP up, everyone's going to have their servo skulls. So we're going to be able to get a few back. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Why well, didn't work out, did it? I didn't match that little wall. Oh dear. He's so good. Oh, I didn't see him. Oh, cheeky death mark. If I shoot him, he's just going to go away. Oh, but I've kind of commit down here now. That's only, there's only one place to get cock points from. Kind of stuffed this up a little bit. That way. Okay, it's not too bad. Can I see him? No. I think I'm going to back him back up a bit. It's a bit brash for that one. I didn't. Well, I'm more complacent, really. I didn't see that other guy. I think he's he's good for now. Can I heal one of these guys? Does when really he need it yet? Probably could do it now, though. Brilliant Overwatch, dude. I like it. Taking a beating. I can take a hit. Let's just do it. Let's just take a hit. I should be taking by it. I'll be able to see that guy.
I think that is going to be a safe bet. There it goes, absorbed it well anyway. He's got a bit of shielding. So now if he's my reducer. Good shot in this guy. We can duck out of cover and we should be able to use the scanner, give that last cock point. Cool, that's not bad. But he definitely needs to heal. So there's no no cog points left to get. We do have two. Just so let's get right next to this guy. See so we can flame just those two and not our guy. Yeah, that looks good. going there. I can't believe this flowed one's still doing a funky little dance. That's mad. Sort him out. Oh no, it's misery. No? Destruction. Yeah, I've killed him. I've got the cognition, but he's still there. <laughs> oh dear. And it actually counts as. Oh, is that because of this guy here? Does that count as melee combat? used our last cognition point but it's going to make a little safe haven for those guys we can gather some again now anyway out that guy will be able to see him. First things first, we've got to get in there and scan this. Get the black stone. Let's see what this guy's on. Four oh, bits too physical. What are we doing? Four to six. That's going to do a minimum of two. I could get him. If I don't get him, now I'm going to finish him off with the opportunity attack. So, yeah, we go. Got him anyway. Brilliant. Get back down towards this. This one, yeah. So let's get him out of here. Got four. So let's use that. Get some more damage and crit chance. Get a little blast of flame. Purify with fire. He still clipped into the bubble. Oh, 
That makes it a bit more interesting. Let's poke this one. here and then you should be able to make it over here that's quite a result if anything you can use both of them up but I think it's going to be worthwhile. There you go, dropped one. He's going to have that burn damage. Oh, I can actually move within the blue still. Yeah, give him a whack as well. Six, that's pretty good. So we should only go on three. Yep. So hopefully when he goes to move away from us, our opportunity attack will kill him. get a chance to destroy that second terminal but we at least got the black stone from it we did destroy the first one which brought our awakening down dead Katara is pinned up against a wall by blade speared through his body it seems strange for the flayed one to leave a corpse behind without skinning and dismembering it perhaps this discovery would reward examination or perhaps it is a trap curiosity take the body down and examine it caution leave the body alone Callousness. Shoot down the body from a distance. If it's a trap, it should be deactivated so as Katari do not get caught out by it. I think that's very wise. The cohort riddles the corpse with gunfire. The body explodes in a burst of radiation as the booby trap is tripped. The cohort exults in the knowledge they have not been outsmarted by the Necrons, though the gunfire and triggering of the trap have surely given away the location. But we didn't get any more awakening, and we do get three cognition points which is lovely so because you managed to end that on one i think i might just nip us up that way what do we reckon yeah i think we'll be all right Red one. So a single port designed for a Necron canoptic creature extrudes from the device. There we go. Goal equals a vivisection. Recover if possible. Okay. 
A lone flayed one is trapped in a malfunctioning doorway. Its lower limbs are crushed, but it has not been damaged enough to cause its teleportation protocols to engage. Oh, look at him down there, all trapped. Skin. Wary of the Necron teleporting away, tried retrieve only its gore recovering of skin. Seize. Attempt to recover the flayed one intact. Scourge. No flayed one can truly be safe. Destroy the Xenos with flame. Normally, well in favour of flame. We want to try and get something out of this. So if we get the skin, we're probably going to at least get something. If we go to seize it, we're kind of worried it might teleport away with one of our guys attached to it. So let's grab the skin. That's a black stone. The cohort tear the fleshy covering off the flayed one, revealing its skeletal metallic form underneath. A glimpse of this is all they get, however, as it quickly teleports away. A shroud of human skin causes revulsion in the cohort that cannot be entirely overcome by their emotional dampening procedures. That's it, freaked them out a bit. Gone all the way up to three. Then we're going to backtrack. I'm gonna go take these guys on, try and bring it back down a bit. Like we've got lots of scan terminals as well. So, high possibility of lots of blackstone recovery here. that as well because I don't think it's going to knock him away because he's on the diagonal. No, it's not going to do any damage anyway. Okay. End of that turn. Close combat for him. Okay, last bit of cognition. Wonder if 
progress as I can. Cool. Let's do that. Uh, I think I'm going to use my Sanctus Cannon, so I just want to check if I is going to get both of them. Yeah, I don't want to waste it on just one guy. some points. Let's get right up in there. Cool. So now I can use that to get all three of them. Okay, that's pretty good. Great job that round. Great job. And my vanguard can fire. That worked out pretty good. Let's move him up a little bit. Get him in some cover. Send this guy. I think we'll go up this way. I think Minaris there has got that one on lockdown. So we should be able to use our, our little stabby stick. Clears that body up. Um, yeah, let's move him up a little bit. Keep him in the blue though. as well. So let's not do that. Let's so finish this guy off. Yeah, it did as well. Result. <laughs> Still got a shot from him. Bugger. Oh well. That's the last enemy. We haven't even got close to these yet. Let's drag this out just a little bit. I want some about Blackstone. One, we're going to pick up three. There we go. Lots of glorious black stone. I'm just going to leave them there. Just 
skip these guys quickly. Get back to the swamp. mission. We'll go down a little bit under three. It should be more like it. Let's heal you up, ready for the next round. Just don't have to do anything with him just yet. cognition there. We're going to have awakening at two and a bit. Yeah, two and a bit. Well, that's much better. We were we were going to go into that last encounter. We're on, I think, was it three or four? I think it was three, but nearly at four. So again, because we're coming through an area we've already travelled, the awakening's not going up anymore. side, more likely to come out the doors, two, three, four on that side, so all the guys pushed up, let's get the vanguard in, put it behind that one, let's get one servitor in as well, in fact no, let's bring them both in, we're in the last encounter, may as well, got one, two, three points we can get some cognition from. So we should be okay. So we should be able to finish him off our stabby stick. Oh mate, stabby stick for the win. Right, let's get him on this platform ready to go over. So he's got some good shield and he should be um he should be pretty resistant. Resilient rather. Bubble up. No, that's not. So 
officers are of a servitor. So let's bring him round, sandwich this blade one. Sleeping there. Don't need to use that yet, I don't think. So this guy should finish him off. Maybe not. This guy definitely will. I'm gonna keep this guy back here. And he's gonna take on any but jump on that platform. Let's just send a couple of guys over. Jeremiah. Yeah, we'll take him as well, I think. Reach any of them? Can. Okay, so we got one of them. Cool, dropped him. Nice. Right, let's see if our scanner can pick that up. No. Those two guys are going over. Veneris here is probably going to stay. Push him up so he's in the middle. So we can either move up to take on anyone that comes on that platform, or if anyone comes out these doors. doing that yet. Just leave him be. There's only one coming over. Right, there we go, there's more. I'm starting to think maybe we should have got a servitor over to help these guys. Only on one. There we go. Stabby stick. Get the cognition from him. Go over, scan for some black stone. It's probably going to make an enemy come out somewhere. No. Let's move him there just to block that off. Tech priest, whoever it is, can probably hit himself. Leave it there for now. That movement is ridiculously crap.
we're starting to get fat with loot here. Yep, hold it there for now. So we've got Minarius. Should be able to get all three of them from there. Let's definitely get the Sanctus canister on as well. Maybe in for mission now, so let's get him healed up so we don't lose any black stone. Stabby stick. We don't want to waste anything else in him. Shoot and chop this terminal up. Dead, so we need to is get the last one over on the other side. You can hit them all the way from there. Get in. Yep, then he should hopefully. Let's cross, finish him off with that. There we go, got the extra encounter in. I've ended up with two. Brilliant. Mission complete. The archway leading to the lower reaches of the Tomb of Abjau was rigged with demolition charges by the cohort. When they are detonated, the entire section of the tomb collapses, filling in the flayed one's route with massive amounts of rubble and detritus. A flow of flayed ones is stemmed, and the Skatari in the tomb win a rare reprieve. Result. Kepra's happy. Faustinius doesn't... Doesn't really like the Flodons that much. Yeah. Got more healed up, so I haven't lost any Blackstone on them. Got 78 at the moment. Pretty sure we're going to have brought in over a thousand in that run. Says 906. 
1335. So yeah, we got like 1200 and some at Blackstone now, that's the result. Well, there we go guys, no new canticles today again, but that's all good, we've got ones that we're happy with at the moment. Got another mission done, ended up with a 2, so we're only on 30% at the moment, which is brilliant. We've got a lot of life left in this playthrough. Uh, we've got loads of Blackstone we can spend on upgrades next episode, so I can't wait for that. So until then guys, leave us a like and subscribe if you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for the next one, and enjoy the rest of your day. Take care.